Hello people, our 2.2 Geometry Dash private server is now available on your iPhone and iOS. We are working on making it where you don't need a computer to get it, but as of now you need a Windows or a MacBook. This is how to get it on your iPhone using your MacBook. Now that you're on your MacBook, you're just gonna make sure that you're in our Discord server. In the GDPS info, you'll find our link to download. And on there, you're just gonna scroll down, click iOS link right here, download, and then download anyways. It's gonna pop up in your downloads folder right here. Once it is done downloading, you'll just want to drag it to your desktop. Now you're gonna open up another tab and search up sideloadloadly.io. Then you're gonna scroll down, hit Mac OS download, and you're just gonna open it up, drag it over to your applications. Then you're gonna head home, click on it, drag it into your applications again. I already have it, so I just have to click replace. From there, you're just gonna go back into your applications or launch pad. Open up side loady, loadly. Now it's gonna pop up this little message. From there, just open up your settings. Go down to privacy and security. Scroll down and it's going to show that side loady was blocked. Just click open anyways. You're gonna to have to put in your password. You can click close on this, on everything actually. And you're just going to try to open it again. And then this time you just click open. When it opens, you're going to have to put in your iCloud for your phone. Make sure that your phone is plugged into your computer. Then you're just going to drag the IPA onto it. From there, you can go into Advanced Options and you can change the name of the app. GD Pocket Edition. Should already save. And then from there, you're just going to click Start. Now, after it is done, this is what it's going to look like on your iPhone as well as your Mac. After a minute, it will just move over to your phone and download it for you. Now, when you try to open it, it's going to say that, you know, untrusted developer, you just go to settings, general, and then you just go down to VIP and device management, click on it and then click trust. And then from there, you're able to open it. Now that's how to get it on your iPhone. From there, you can just go play and, you know, enjoy it.